National Educator. Hello Alana, welcome to our secondary schools revision in business studies, our lesson 13. The topic of discussion is money and banking and it's me, your teacher, Alfred Maloba. Lana, we have to get the objective of our revision and by the end of the lesson, you should be able to interpret the various questions and give the most appropriate solution. Let's look at our activity number one. We have our question there and the question says explain five functions of money. The award of marks is 10 marks. So what are we supposed to note? So there are key areas that we need to note before we attempt the question and some of these key areas include the following. One, the theme of the question is on money under the topic money and banking. Once you have noted that, we need to remind ourselves what is money. And in business, we refer to money as is a good that is generally accepted or widely accepted in exchange of commodities and payment of bills. So anything that we can accept generally in total and then we can get goods and services from it in exchange or somebody can expect as you pay your bills like water bills and things like that we shall term that as money. Then Lana, we need to know we have been asked about the function. So what are these function? A function that means the purpose of a thing. That is what we term as function. So in that regard, we are required, or in our requirement, is five functions of money. So in that aspect, we need to look at the question. In the question, it is telling us, and the term that they have used in testing us is explain. So we need also to know what we need to do when we are told to explain. In explaining, then it means mentioning the fact as it is precisely then add value to it by showing the effect or the cause or the result of the mentioned fact so note you must bring out the mentioning of that fact then add something add value to it not just a mention and then you stop there so it mean, means it must go a bit deeper. Then after that, we need also to check our question. Which direction is it giving us? So is it giving us a positive direction or a negative direction? We also need to look at the award of marks. If the marks are more, let's say two, then it means we must add more value. If it is one, then we have to give a lesser, a uh, short or a uh, short depth of our answer. In our case, we have five functions, and each of the five functions, then each will get two marks and a total of ten marks. So we can now go and see what is our expected response, and we have our question is explain five functions of money at ten marks. So the first response is serves as a medium of exchange when you'll say medium of exchange now that function has come out and once the function has come out then we add value so what do you mean by medium of exchange then we proceed and say as is used to buy goods and services 